सो हे गाइज वेलकम बैक वन सेकेंड एंड इन टू डेज वीडियो आई वॉज जस्ट ड्रॉइंग द न्यू फेस मॉडल ऑन कंट्रोल नेट सेक्शन एज यू कैन सी आई वॉज जस्ट हैविंग फन विद दिस मॉडल एंड यर आर कपल ऑफ द रिजल्ट दैट आई गॉट विद दिस मॉडल दे वर प्रिटी अमेजिंग एंड दिस मॉडल वॉज वर्किंग रियली फाइन विद द मॉडल दैट आई वॉज वर्किंग एंड आई वॉज वर्किंग विद द आर मार्डा मर्ज मॉडल ओवर हियर लेट मी डेल यू गाइज इट वॉज वर्किंग रियली फैंटेस्टिक एंड वन ऑफ द इंटरेस्टिंग थिंग दैट यू कैन गो एंड एक्सपेरिमेंट ऑन कंट्रोल नेट सेक्शन so first of all let me tell you guys this is a very important thing that you should note about this model this model only works with stable diffusion 2.1 you can see over here this is control net sd 2.1 la ion face version 2 model so this model only works with stable diffusion 2.1 and it is not compatible with stable diffusion 1.5 model so guys let me tell you there are several steps in order to install this control net face model and it's very simple so let's get started with the installation the first thing that you need to do is that come on to your stable diffusion directory i am already on stable diffusion directory go on to your extensions menu see i am already on extensions menu and in extension menu if you have already installed control net model then this file will already exist as the web ui control net so the first thing that you need to do is that make a copy of this folder or delete this folder from this section so i have already made a copy of this i have cut this folder from over here and made a copy on my another folder so So for safe side you can make a backup of this folder so i have already made a backup so after deleting this folder click on over here and type cmd type cmd and press enter and after pressing the enter the command window will open and the next thing that you need to do is that come on to this website i will link this website in the description below you need to copy this line git clone the steps are already given over here how to install you can follow this as well so you can copy this and you can paste it on the command line. so paste it over here and press enter so after pressing the enter you will automatically install this files on this stable diffusion web ui control net so the reason to do this is because if you compare it with the older control net file let me show you this is the newer control net file go on to control net on annotator you will see there will be a media pipe face and this is the preprocessor that we need in order to use this face model if i show you the older files this is my older control net files like right? see this over here i am already i have already backup this and in this you can see there is no media pipe phase going on over here so that's the reason that you need to do this so you can get this let me tell you this is the media pipe pre processor that we want in order to work with this model so that's the first thing and the next thing that you need to do is that you need to download this model control net sd 2.1 la ion model so in order to get this model let me tell you where to get this model you can go on to this website i will link this website in the description go on to this website and download download this control net as the 2.1 la ion face model so that's the thing that you need to download press the download option over here and where you need to paste it let me tell you guys i'm already on stable diffusion web ui directory you can see stable diffusion web ui directory go on to the models go on to the models and on models you can go on to control net and i have already downloaded this model over here you can see this is the model that i have downloaded save it and that's the only thing that you need to do this is the second step so guys we have now already completed our two steps and the third step that you need to do is that you need to add this command on web ui user dot back so in order to add this command come on to this over here i am already on stable diffusion web ui directory come down over here go on to web ui user dot back right click and show more option and after showing more of you can go on edit as well or edit with notepad so let's go with and in this you need to copy paste or you can copy paste it as well you can copy this line no half okay you need to add this line on command section so just copy this and come over here and paste it that's the only thing that you need to do and this is the third step save it over here and close it so basically now we have completed our third step as well and now what you need to do is that run your stable diffusion with web ui user dot bad so let me explain you the last step as well go on to your settings and in the settings option come down to control net and in control net section you can see i have already edited this over here config file for control net model basically this is the last step that you need to do you just need to rename this file from 15 to 21 okay that's the only thing that you need to do come over here you can see this was 15 over here i have already renamed my file you can see it's 21 that's the only thing that you need to do the reason to this This is because this model control net sd 2.1 la ion face model and this face model only supports stable diffusion 2.1 model okay so that's the only
only thing that you need to do and that's basically the last step about renaming this file so that's how you can install this and yes you can enjoy it as well and once again let me tell you guys let me be clear this model only works with stable diffusion 2.1 based model and let me tell you guys this is the model that i am using and in order to download stable division 2.1 based model come on to civit ai you can go on over here and you can select sd 2.1 or sd 2.1 both of this just filter it and you will get all of the stable division 2.1 based model so yes you can work with any of the stable division 2.1 model as well and now guys let's test this model because i was already testing onto this model you can definitely see this was the phase that i was using and and this was the result that I got. This was the map that I generated with using this face. And yes, I was generating some amazing result with this. Just like I was going with young toddler. So now let's go with young boy and let's see what result do we get. Let's generate and let's see what result do we get. So guys, as you can see, after changing on to the young boy, this is the result that I got. And you can see definitely amazing result, right? And yes, it's smiling as well. So that's the result that I got. And yes, this was the map. And once again, let's go with like old man or or old woman so we will go with old woman and let's see what result do we get now so guys as you can see that is the result that i got with old woman and yes this is definitely working with armada merge model okay so yeah it's working fine and what if we change this face as well let's go with different face and let's see what result do we get so we are using now different face over here and what we will do first of all let's see if it's working or not preview annotator we will do preview annotator and yes it's like generating this face so yeah we got this result now and let's generate one more time and let's see if we can get this result with old woman as well so let's see guys and yeah hope so we can get the result let's see so yes guys uh you can see that is the result that i got pretty interesting i am just loving this because you can see this was the image that we use pretty amazing result and yes that was the map that we generated and if we compare it with this result definitely yes uh, this is working really fine with i can definitely say that armada merge model is also working fine with this and now let's go with different thing let's go with something like joker let's go with joker and let's see what result do we get we, we won't go with laughing because this face this face is not laughing this is just a simple face so what we will go we will go just with joker and let's see what result do we get so guys you can see with the joker that is the result that i got and yes pretty interesting result right one more thing let's go with different let's go with different thing with and yes we will go with the earlier phase and let's see what result do we get now with the joker okay so we will test this and let's see if it's working with joker or not so now let's generate and let's see what result do we get so guys as you can see that is the result that i got with this face and yes this was the map that was generated with with this face so that is the result that i got and yeah pretty interesting thing that you can go and mess around with this model the face model and yeah that's the thing that i wanted to talk about and one more thing if you want to work with sd 1.5 model just like this scanny model depth model these are 1.5 models right and if you want to work on this then yes one more thing last thing go on to settings and in this section just change this to 1.5 so in order to work with 1.5 base model you need to change it to 1.5 so that's the only thing that you need to do and so isn't it interesting thing so yes guys that's the only thing that i wanted to talk about this face control net model and yeah pretty interesting thing so yes guys that's it for today and yes i will be back with more and more videos tomorrow till then have a good day bye guys love you all guys bye guys